Hello and welcome to the Reventuli Coast. This might be the most beautiful location here in the Hunter Call of the Wild. And uh, today, we are going to be hunting some waterfowl. I can hear them up there. Oh my gosh, look at them flying around, enjoying their life. Well, they're going to get to know some 12 gauge birdshot here soon. Sorry to be so morbid, but wow, look at this place, man. We've got this beautiful white and blue cabin complete with canoe. We are out here on this island down on the bottom right side of the map. This is basically Bird Island. It's where all of the mallards and ducks and all kinds of other stuff spawn in you can see him flying around up there oh my gosh we can spot him that's a eurasian widget the always return to the palearctic region to breed maybe they find the aurora borealis romantic what do you think i don't think the ducks care about the aurora borealis but still very cool to be here so let's go inside let's get ready i'm very excited for this i have never been duck hunting myself but it looks like a lot of fun and i'm excited to check it out in this game so our current setup has a 12 gauge shotgun with bird shot just kind of a pump shotgun could take a little test fire there so that's going to be how we take down most of them we also have a 22 lr with a scope on it, we could potentially take down some smaller fowl with this as well. If we go to the store here, we want to purchase some layout blinds. We're going to get the Incognito Deluxe Water Layout Blind for $16,000. Pretty expensive, but that's all right. And then we need to think about what kind of decoys we want to end up putting out. So we know we can have Eurasian Teals. I'm going to get 10 drakes for four grand, and then we can also get 10 hens for four grand and then i think we definitely want to take on some mallards that's kind of the traditional duck that you think of so we're going to go 10 drakes and hens i believe we have tufted ducks here so we can get 10 more drakes and hens and then i know we've got canadian geese but we're going to have to go north for that i personally do not like geese so i'm looking forward to that part of the episode hopefully we're going to have enough space in the backpack to deal with all these so we're going to put our eurasians in there we're going to put our mallards in there, tufted ducks in there. We've got our dog biscuits. That's very, very important. And last but not least, we're going to have our water layout blind. We've got barely enough capacity. Looks good to me. Now, the last thing we're going to do is go into our kennel. So we've got our bloodhound here. This was the original dog you could have in this game, but they recently added the Labrador Retriever. So this came out, I think like a month or two ago. I'm not sure, but uh, we're going to have a yellow lab. We already had Cooper as our bloodhound. So we're obviously going to go with Coda here, even though Cooper probably fits this a little bit better, but that's all right. Let's set him as active. And we now have a retriever who's going to go get our waterfowl that we shoot out of the sky. Where is he? Heel. Hello, where are you at, buddy? There he is. Who's a good boy? Welcome, Coda. How you doing, buddy? Good boy. Praise? <laughs> Give treat. That's what I'm talking about. Who's a good boy? Welcome, Coda. We are going to be going duck hunting for the very first time together. And uh, you can see he's got a little... Uh, I mean, we could pet him first. This is more important. Sorry, let's let's take a little aside here. But uh, he's got a little little retrieve thing. So once we shoot something and it's floating down in the water, we can hit retrieve, and he'll go get him. So uh, let's uh, let's go ahead and get out there, buddy. I'm thinking we probably want to go somewhere out in here. So let's just take a left, head down to the water again. I have never been duck hunting. I kind of know what to do. I watched a quick tutorial, so. It should be interesting and uh, should be a lot of fun. Just look at this landscape. This is one of the most beautiful places on earth. Welcome to Finland, baby. I love this part of the world, man. We posted a Finland vlog when we went and saw Icon of the Seas while it was being built. We've had Norway vlogs going up, so if you guys haven't seen those, make sure you go check it out but uh yeah man this this is just absolutely incredible i'm feeling this spot right here you think we can set this up feels like a big open area oh he's he's running around he's swimming he's liking it all right looks like we do have a little bit of activity we've got some eurasian widgeons flying around those appear to be pretty popular gonna see if we see anything else there's something way off in the distance that looks like one of the things that just kind of like floats around in your eye We've got Eurasian teals. Do you know what a doubling duck is? It's a type of duck who doesn't dive to feed. The Eurasian teal is one of the smallest doubling ducks. Golden eyes. 
James Bond. All right, we're going to set this up. I'm going to face out towards the water, and we can put it kind of like that. And then we're going to take all of our ducks, and we're going to want to place these all over the place. We're going to have drakes and hens. We're just going to kind of put them in a, a semicircle around our, uh, our blind here. Now, I, I'm pretty sure... We could have multiple different types of, of ducks all over the place. Like I, I don't think you have to stick just to mallards or just to anything else. So we're just we're gonna put a bunch in a giant semicircle all over the place and hope for the best here. But yeah, guys, vlog channel's been popping off. If you guys haven't been seeing the vlogs going up. It's been absolutely crazy. Very excited about that. So make sure you guys go check it out if you get the chance. But let's go ahead and get a bunch of these guys, buddy. Let's uh, lay down. Lay down. You just stay right there. You're a good boy. You you lay down, be quiet, and don't let them see you. We are in our blind here, and now we need to get these guys to come to us. So I guess if we use our duck collar. Wait, which duck collar is this? Right now, we're using our Beacon Deluxe duck collar. We've also got the Beacon Deluxe Eurasian Widgeon and the Eurasian Teal. So we're just we're going to start with this. I think this might be more generic duck. We'll see if this works. I don't know how much to actually hit it. So the idea is they're going to end up flying in here and then they, they should see all the ducks around and they, they might land or at least get close enough that we could take some shots at them. It's just like a big duck party out here and we've just got a, a floating log of sticks and we're hoping to convince them that, hey, it's okay to come hang out. Oh, oh. Oh! Landed right next to us and the dog. I probably could have shot him. I wasn't ready for it. Look at Koto over there. He's just ready to go. Come on. Come come back down again. I mean, we could take shots from here. I probably should have taken a shot there. Where'd he go? Shoot. Well, we've missed absolutely everything. That's unfortunate. Coda can't even look at us. Look at him over there. He's he's really upset with what happened right there. Um, I'm sorry, buddy. Okay, let's try this again. Almost went for it. He thought about landing. I, did he see the dog? How did he know not to, to land here? I thought birds were supposed to be dumb. We've got a whole crew coming in here. They like, like the sound of what we've got going on. They like the temperature of the water. They like the little community meeting we have come on in always looking for new members in the hoa let's go guys come on we're getting swarmed right now dude trev if you don't get a hit here i'm gonna be so disappointed in you he's done got him let's go they didn't hear that one dude they're gonna come down anyway no freaking way two down there let's go can we get a third one come on lead them just start spraying and praying we're fine buddy go get him Go retrieve. Which one are you going to go get? Go go retrieve that one. Yes, that one. That's not good, boy. Who's a good boy? He's going to bring him back to us. That is amazing. And he dropped them off. Is it going to come over here? We could confirm our trophy. Look at that. We got a Eurasian teal. It was a class one, so a little bit smaller of one, but we did get a gold rating on it. Had a kill shot with the 22. That's what I'm talking about. We could see where it went in. Ooh, nice quick shot to the lower neck looks good so let's go ahead and uh we don't want to harvest that let's go ahead and accept that then we could also oh he goes and gets everything you don't even have to tell him to get the other ones he's just gonna go get that and it's gonna come this way we don't have to do anything we don't have to leave our blind honestly we could just keep calling in the uh the ducks out there who's a good boy that's what i'm talking about so it looks like we got a mallard as well it was a level one female see where we ended up getting them. I mean, these guys are so small. Really, anything is going to work against them. But let's uh, let's get our duck collar back out and get back after it. I kind of want to try. Oh, we should probably tell him to go lay down. What, buddy, what are you doing underwater? Can can we maybe can we? Well, don't don't lay down underwater, but maybe go lay down somewhere where you're not going to spook the birds. Okay, and and please try not to drown. That would be really sad. Go lay down, dude. He's just doing whatever he wants. Go lay down. Go lay down. Coda, come on. I feel bad naming him after my real dogs because Coda's downstairs right now. Like, what the heck, bro? I'm not doing anything. Dude, go lay down. We're going to have to get out. We leveled up. I love to see that. Come here, buddy, please. 
heal. I'll give you some praise. And then now please lay down. Please stop swimming. This is not a swimming situation. This is not a swimming situation. Good boy. Takes a lot of patience, that's for sure. You've got so many targets swarming you. You're always wondering when it's time to, to bring it out, but we're okay. You know what we could do? We should try the, the next generation of hunting with our electronic collar and the next one, but let's just keep keep this up for now. I kind of like using the actual old school collar. Koda's being good, just laying and licking his paws in the water, his tail's wagging, so he's happy. You just stay out of the line of fire, buddy, and we're gonna be okay. We've got a few coming in. Not sure what these guys are. Let's take a look. Eurasian teals. We've got another group coming in over here of tufted I love ducks. The tufted duck. The males have cute haircuts, and the females look like they have lipstick on the end of their bills. Well, we'll see if we can get them to come down then. Oh, something just landed next to us, I think. Oh, right there. Can we get him with the shotgun? Bird shot. Got him. Two for one right there. Got another one. Got another one. Let's go. Can you go get all of them? That was three. That was the best one we had. Go retrieve, buddy. Go get them. A one already floated back to us here. Eurasian teal. That's what I'm talking about. You can see where the bird shot went in there. We'll accept that. He should be on his way. I don't know how far he can go to figure this. Dude, bird hunting dogs are insane. And you know what's even crazier? Is sometimes when I'll take Coop out to potty, something will happen off in the distance in the lake and Coop points. And he's never been a dog like that. He's not a hunting dog. He has no idea what he's doing. It's just like years and years and years of that breed it into him into his his species i guess but he'll like stick his nose out and his tail goes straight and he lifts a leg and it's like bro you wouldn't even know what a bird is if you saw it like come on you're not joking you're not fooling anybody but it's it's kind of crazy to think about how that's just been baked into his dna for so long is that Koda over there he's coming over the thing oh my God. okay three three and one is pretty good we had one collateral and then we got a third one as well. That felt amazing. Dude, this is a cool way to hunt. Just sitting here, letting him do all the work. Confirm this trophy, got a Eurasian teal. I wanna get some, some tufted ducks. So let's accept this. We're gonna get out of our blind and we're gonna set up the most ridiculous and boring way to hunt, but it's gonna be fine. So we're gonna take all of our handheld traditional collars off. We're gonna put this electric collar on here we're gonna get back into our blind and these are all the things we can hunt here white tail tough to duck eurasian teal mallard brown bears eurasian lynx raccoon dog anyway we're gonna go for the tufted duck start the mating call they're gonna think they're about to get some and your boy is gonna be ready when they come flying in don't even have to do anything don't have to press any buttons i can keep our gun out or keep our What's it called out? Try to spot them from a, a ways away. That's a mallard there. Let's see what these guys are. They're a little bit too far away. Oh, we should probably have have homeboy lay down. Go boy. Go lay down. Again, laying down on the water. I, I mean, stealth. That's what I'm talking about. Is this a tufted? That's a mallard. He landed right in front of us. How stupid can you be? I'm going to let you live because that, that's embarrassing. The problem is I don't think we have any tufted decoys so they're probably not gonna drop down here okay i bought some we've got some tufted duck i guess did maybe we already had some but we're we're gonna have some more now i think you can get bonuses up to 40 ducks is it 20 of each or just 20 in total i'm not sure but we're we're gonna have some more tufted ducks here either way so we're gonna have some drakes we're gonna have some hens it looks like i think we did have some before but we're gonna have even more now. The more the merrier. We're just a big happy family here. Now the thing is, is we do have a pretty serious zone now, like a, a death zone. So I don't know if we're gonna get any more animals, any more ducks or anything to come this way, but we'll find out. We've got mallards coming in. We could potentially take these guys on. Looks like two separated from the pack. Is that how they do it? Did they start coming in and hanging out or what's their plan? It's like they circled back it's interesting how these guys work huh why did they split off from the pack what are they doing what's their plan are they thinking about coming down here also like if you're if you're a bird hunter when do you think to pop off when you can get like two or three or four do you take your shot whenever you get the chance 
Can we hit them from here? I would imagine if you let them enough, they would go down from here. Maybe not. Oh. It kind of looked like maybe, but maybe not. I think they know the block's hot and the ops are after him. We're going to have to uh, just give it a second here. I'm really tempted to try to be a hero. It's not working. Those are tough to ducks. You can see the little... Oh gosh, they're coming in. Maybe. Bro, I have no idea how much to lead them. These bullets are all going to come down somewhere, hopefully out at sea. All right, we got to be more patient, Trev. This is a game of waiting. Okay, we're starting to get some more. Oh, 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 oh. Nope. Oh, no. Trev, you can't miss that. You got to lead him. You got to lead him, baby. Come on. Let's get the 22 out. Those were mallards. I really wanted a tough to duck, but we didn't get any. Still not too bad. I think I think two and a little thing there is, is a little bit better. All right, buddy. Time to wake up. Time to get to work. He's just like Coda in real life. Good boy. Go get him. I thought that might be another one right there. Nope. Go get him. Come on. Wake up. I love that it actually takes him a minute. That's funny. This is honestly just so cool. Look at him go. Look at him bringing his duck across. Just so proud, so happy. Dude's got a job. He feels fulfilled. We all want to feel like we're wanted, we're needed. We, you know, somebody's asking for us. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. That was a good looking one. Very pretty mallard there. We'll accept that. And he's going to go grab another one on the other side of the rock. Dude, this is so cool. Look at him go. He's just so happy. This is amazing. Good job, buddy. Another mallard here. Female. The purple wings in the back there. I just, I really think these, these birds are very beautiful creatures. So go ahead and accept that. Let's see if we can get him to, uh, to calm down and lay down. And I'm hoping we can get some tufted ducks, but there's no guarantee. Who's this guy coming in right next to us? Thought about it. Nope. That's so funny how it's like they're, they're coming in for a landing. They're like, abort, abort, bolter, bolter. Let's get out of here. Not going to do that. Not too shabby. Good choice, buddy. If you want me to be honest, I feel a little bit bad. I'm going to dismantle our blind here. I'm going to let these guys be. Let's also pick this thing up. We're definitely going to want this. And I'm thinking we're going to end up going up north. So if we take a look at the map again, this island is all ducks. Anything that's a duck, that's there. I think you can find geese on the entire map, but... I watched a video and it said they primarily show up up in the north, so I got us one set up up there. Oh my gosh, all of them in here, dude. Can See, like, if I lead that, does that not hit? I feel like birdshot should go farther than that. But, yeah, we're going to go up to this camp up north that I preset for us. Probably to this spot. We could fast travel up there. I'm going to go take on some geese. They've attacked me multiple times. They've attacked my pets. Like, I, I just, I really don't like geese. So I'm going to use this as a therapy moment for us to take on some geese. Oh my gosh, this is such different territory up here. So we've got a lot of water. I'm imagining we're going to want to put our blind down in the water. We've got something here. Let's head this way. We've got all these... Those are some nice tracks. Want to follow them? Walking trails and stuff. This is so cool. And it looks like we've got a bunch of birds up here as well. But we're going to try to get some... Uh, we should probably grab some Canada geese decoys. So let's get our blind set up. Same thing as before. We're going to have him right there. And this is really interesting. The sheer number of options they have for geese. There are sentry geese. There are feeding geese, which I think is this right here. There's like floating geese, searching geese, all kinds of stuff. Doing all sorts of, of different moves and, and things. So we're going to put them all over the place. I got Canada geese as well as some other options. So hopefully we're going to attract a lot of these very mean, very hostile, very formidable creatures. We already have some coming in. Should we get inside? Hold on. Let me see our inventory. We should have a Canada goose collar. I'm going to put this on eight. Let's get to it. Come on down, buds. It's just a, a goose party down here. Canada goose party. I really like using the collars, dude. I don't know. It's it's pretty cool. It's crazy how fast these guys come in here. Now, I, I would imagine we're probably going to want to use... These guys are a little bit bigger. We probably want to use the 22. I don't know how effective the bird shot's going to be. I guess it gives us a larger area if they're up close. But we'll see if we can get them to land in this little pond up here. Come on down, friends. The price is right. 
We got some some Plinko ready to play. You try to win a free car. Used to watch that every weekday before school. Is it still on? Does it still happen? I'm not sure. Shoot, they're not coming down. Oh, oh, yes, they are. Yes. They are. No. Are you freaking... We got him! Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Can you go get him, buddy? Is he too far away or do you got that? Where are you at? They all left instantly. These must be pretty smart animals. It looks like he might have the track on it. Or maybe not. It wasn't over there. It was over there. But I think you're, I think you're going the wrong way. Are you trying to look for it? Or do you just have no idea? You just don't have anything going on between your ears. I think that's that's more of the, the issue. I cannot believe we clutched up on that last one right there. That was insane. It was over in this area, right? That's the bird right there. That's what I'm talking about. Coda, you want to go get him? Are you with me? Come on. Go retrieve. Go get him. He's over there. Go get him. Good boy. That's what I'm talking about. Just had to show him the right way a little bit. Can he get a bird that big? He can't. <laughs> No way. Look at him go. That's what I'm talking about. Again, he, he needs a job. So we're going to say a, uh, a job well done on that one. Oh, they're coming back. They want some more action. Oh, we got him out of the sky. That's what I'm talking about. Go get him, buddy. We got another one. Go retrieve. Go get it. You don't see it, do you? Oh, no, he sees it. Wow, dude, this is amazing. We get some more? It's definitely not easy. He should be bringing this one back. Who's a good boy? That's what I'm talking about. So our first one here, let's see where we got him in the wing. It's crazy how that's just all it takes. So we'll accept that second one. Maybe a better shot. Ah, still just a flesh wound. I wouldn't mind hitting some organs. All right, but can you sit? Good boy. How about a, uh, a, little, a little treat? Who's a good boy? Been working hard for me. I'm going to work hard for you. We're already leveling him up, improving our relationship and stuff. Let's uh, let's play. Who's a good boy? Who wants to play? Yeah. Sit, shake, do all your things. All right. Let's get back to work. Okay, buddy? I know you like your jobs. I'm going to set up our little collar here. We're going to get back in the blinds. Definitely going to be going for uh, more of the... Uh, let's try some maybe gray lag goose. That sounds really not good, but that's fine. So we'll hit him with the gray lag goose call and then I'll hit him with the uh, the Canada goose call and we'll see if we can get some more in here. I would like to get two for one. Maybe we end up, we, we should probably make this Canada goose instead of gray lag and let's have it all the same. Everyone wants to mate with y'all. Come on, big daddies, come on down. We got plenty of dime pieces down here ready to go. They can't even contain themselves. They're just calling to you. So come on down just a little bit closer and uh, you're going to have the time of your life. Might just be the last event of your life. Kind of sad when you put it like that. I don't know when I get more, but it's, it's, oh, that, okay. That got me. I thought that was one next to us answering us. So that's obviously a, a pretty good caller. We got one coming in, two coming in, three coming in. Two, three. Where's the last one? Watch out. Uh, Coda, please don't don't get hit by this. Come on, we can get one more. Oh my gosh, we got another one. Is there any more? Woo, that's what I'm talking about. All right, buddy. You know what time it is. Let's go ahead and get out there and confirm these things. Please let me get out of my blood. Dude, this is such a fun way to hunt. So there's a Canada goose. Good looking shot right there. Hit him with the, dude, the, the, Bird shot is OP for sure. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. We got another one here. Another bird shot. You gonna go get the other one? I already picked that one up. You go get the other ones. Who's a good boy? Get him. Good boy. That's what I'm talking about. Another one right here. Beautiful. And then we've got one more over yonder. You probably didn't see that one. But we certainly got it done. So, man, this, this is good. This is a totally different way to hunt. Obviously a lot easier. Honestly, I am so impressed with just how incredible the decoys and the blind and stuff work like you can just chill and they come to you it's it's kind of miraculous i'm not gonna lie look at him good boy bring me back that goose i hate geese and they they deserved every inch of lead that they got today so hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching i'm gonna see you guys 
in some more of the Hunter episodes soon. Really appreciate it. Final one there. Got him in the wing. That's what I'm talking about. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed. Let me know what we should hunt next. And uh, I'll see you guys there. Peace out.